Coach Norton. Uh, talk to you at the, when you first got here. Uh, it was hard to even assess the team because you had just got here. But now that you had your feet uh, wet for a little while now, what are you seeing in the group of guys, linebacker core? Well, I'll tell you, I'm very happy with the group. Uh, they show up every day. They uh, work really hard, really highly competitive. They like each other. They're, they're making each other better, and I think that uh, they're going to really make a really strong impact. Has anything uh, stood out to you in this part of the OTAs about any of the guys right now and just what you're seeing overall? Well, just that, you know, everybody's showing up every day. Everybody's happy. Everybody's working hard. You know, people care. The, the guys are, are really genuinely trying to get better. They're genuinely trying to connect and do all the things that good teams do. You know, they want to win, so they're listening, and they're going to do the things that, that winners do. One of the guys uh, that's been here for a while, uh, Jamin Davis, uh, you know, what are you seeing from him as far as how you want to use him and just how he's progressing along, learning a new system again? Right. Um, Jamin is a fantastic person. Love coaching him. Really highly competitive. He's an outstanding athlete. And um, and I think with Bobby and Frankie, Frankie and, and Jordan, and Michael and all the guys, they really bring out the best in one another. So I'm excited about all of them, and Jamin in particular, because he's so young and has so much uh, ability, and he's going to be so good that this is exactly what he needs to see players like Bobby, players like Frankie, young players like uh, Jordan. Um, they're really high competitors. And... Uh, it's going to be really special to see how it all turns out. What makes Jamin so lovable or, or uh, to, yeah, to coach? He is lovable. Lovable to coach. <laughs> <laughs> he's just, um, you know, he's, he's smart and uh, he has a great smile. Uh, he's passionate about what he does. He cares. And he shows up every day, asks questions. Uh, things that you talk about, he's able to carry him over to the field yeah. and then bring you back, you know, more questions. And uh, he's a really good athlete. He's fast. He's big. I mean, everything you want. If, if we, were, we were to define the linebacker in a dictionary, what it should look like, you see Jamin's face. So he's the type of guy that uh, he's certainly the type of guy that you enjoy coaching. Yeah, as you head into the, the veteran camp next week and everything, what are you hoping to see out of these guys? Gets a little more physical next week. Well, we've had a, a fantastic camp so far, and we only, we only have a few more days left. Mm -hmm. Then when we come back in the summer, it's for real. There's, it's, it's going right into the season. So you really like to really culminate as you finish, to really finish strong. And all the things that we've learned and see the guys really play fast and confident and smart and tough and really look like a winning football team. Really look organized and compete and be uh, enthusiastic. So you want to finish, you know, on a good note. And then you have great momentum going into the summer and when you come back for camp, you know, you're feeling really good about what you've accomplished. So you're ready to take on all comers. Because everybody is new to the system and everything, how has the learning been and the guys picking up things fast uh, to, to really go from, as they say, uh, crawl, uh, walk, oh, and then run? Mm -hmm. Well, they've been fantastic. Everyone's coming in early. Everyone's staying late. We have extra meeting times. You know, they want to get extra meeting times with their coaches. You know, everyone's genuinely excited about, you know, what our, you know, the, the new system, the new coaches, everything's new. Um, and it's, it's a good, positive vibe. Guys are connecting. So, uh, you know, so far, so good. So as they take a break after next week, what is the message that you want these guys to take 
uh, so that when they come back in late uh, July for for the real deal, uh, what, what what are you leaving with them? What do they have to do to stay ready? Well, the main thing is understand what we're building now. And don't come back in the, in the summer and, you, and forget everything <laughs> and make a start over. Because these are, you know, great teams and championship teams and competitive teams all built in the offseason. Mm -hmm. And the part between now and then when we come back, there's a little space in there. Yeah. You have to work your tail off. And you can't take, you know, you can't, we might be breaking from each other, but you're not breaking from work. You know, you have a certain routine. You have certain uh, ways that you study. You know, you have certain ways that you get together with others and continue growing. So by the time that we come back together in, uh, in late July, early August, that you're continuing what we're, uh, we've already started now and not starting over. Thanks, Coach. As Coach said, don't forget what you learned during that break. <laughs> That's right. <laughs>